Hello everyone. Welcome back to Garden Fever. Just wanted to bring you a real quick episode on uh, using cardboard as a weed block. I've seen it on several YouTube videos and read it on several web, uh, uh, web pages. And I uh, wanted to kind of give my breakdown because I've tried it and there are pros and cons to it. So I wanted to kind of, for my channel, I wanted to kind of give you the pros and cons to it. Uh, one of the pros is it does work. It will snuff out weeds, it will kill grass, and uh, it will kind of lay a path. Uh, if you cover it with mulch, like you lay it down and you cover it with mulch, it's not too bad as a weed block. It will slowly deteriorate and over after about a year or two it will decompose and then eventually come back. Um, I'm gonna break away and give you an example here, but I found one one major negative to them that makes me not really like it very much besides the fact that it can get unsightly and I don't know if you can see it at this angle uh, but I'm gonna break away and uh, show you another another example but it's pretty unsightly when it's a decomposed it looks very trashy so I mean if, like I said if you cover it with mulch it might not be too bad but uh, it has one fundamental flaw and that's slugs absolutely love hanging out underneath it and I mean love it. In fact, if you're trying to attract slugs, cardboard's a good way to do it. So without further ado, I'm gonna break away and uh, show you a, a, an example. I'm gonna lift up one of my cardboard and show you how many slugs are under it. This is absolutely devastating to leafy greens and things that you have. So if you have any cardboard block around your leafy greens, this could spell trouble for you. So I wanted to share that with my viewers and anybody that came across this video. Um, with that, I'll uh, skip over there and we'll see you soon. So one of the problems with using cardboard to kill your weeds and stuff is one, it's unsightly, two, it blows around in the wind, and three, is it attracts slugs. See, look at that. Slugs absolutely love hanging out under the cardboard and I'm not sure why I don't know if they eat it but as you can see we have one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty twenty slugs just under that one oh twenty 22, 23. I imagine there's some more under here if we really got down and looked. So, even though it does kill weeds good, there is a drawback, and that's it attracts slugs big time. So, if your cardboard is near any of your leafy greens, you're going to get jacked um, by slugs. They're going to eat them. And that's the problem. That's one of the one of the negatives to using cardboard. It does work, as you can see, there's no weeds and grass underneath this, but uh, there's lots of slugs. 